Hey guys, this is uh, Puncture here. I'm gonna bring you one of my first tutorials requested by HL2 Scary Boy. Hi, very nice. But can you make a tutorial about the effect at 11 to 12 seconds? It's actually at 9 to 11 seconds in this clip that I made quick for MSK triple up at Nuke. It's this line right here. Okay. First thing you're gonna do is start up Sony Vegas. Actually, the first thing you have to do is already have the clips made and brought through a virtual dub. After you do that, you start up your Vegas. Make sure your settings are fine. It's, uh, 1280 by 720. Uh, best. Okay, what you're gonna do is. Okay, first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna insert uh, one of the clips. And we'll do this right here. And now I'm gonna go and insert the audio so I can make it. Okay, now I'm gonna control drag so it's in sync. There we go. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up the video of the, the Wallach. Okay, and I'm gonna open up the audio. drag so it's synced okay now what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna have to add a video track uh, put the clip you want on top uh, the wall hack over the clip now what you're gonna do is you're gonna make it so the wall hack clip is synced perfectly with the normal clip so the easiest way I found to do this is basically drag the audio clip below delete this track for a second and make these synchronized now since that's synchronized I can just drag the clip over and there we go this should be perfect uh, yep there we go now I'm gonna cut off where I want it to start and end I want it to stop before the shot so I'm gonna I do that, I didn't mean to split both the events. Gonna highlight this. Gonna split it. Delete that part and I'm gonna delete where I wanted to start. I wanted to start around here. Delete. Okay, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn the opacity of the normal clip down to 0%. And now you're gonna go into video effects. And you're gonna add cookie cutter, and grab this one, add it on, circle, and change the shape to oval side. Oh, my bad, I meant oval side. Okay, you can change the shape to oval side. Now, repeat Y, you're gonna change that from 1 to 10. Okay, now you're gonna start off with size at 0. 0 and the X center at zero. And drag it all the way to the end. Make a keyframe. Now you're gonna make the X center to 1.0. Okay, now you're gonna drag it to one to like three key three keyframes above the beginning. Make a keyframe. Okay, we're gonna change the side size to whatever you want it. Uh, in this case, I'm using 100. And I'm gonna drag it all the way to the end. Three keyframes before the end. 
one, two, three. Make a keyframe. Uh, change the size to 100. And it should go through just like that. And what you could do is you can add a feather. Make a feather end. Or you can add a border. In the case which I did, which I added a 0 0.01 border. Okay. And that should be fine. And now what you're going to do is you're going to drag the opacity back up to 100. And then watch it over. And you'll see it go through with the wall hack. Just like that. Okay, now what you do now, just add your colors into your clip. Whatever presets you created. I'm going to add the preset color that I'd already made for this clip. And then I'm going to add a color onto the wall hack clip. So when it goes through, I'll have a nice coloring to the wireframe. And I'm going to use for that, I'm going to use black and white crunch. And the clip will look like this. Okay, now I'm going to split this off, delete this, and delete this, this we don't need that anymore, just use that to sync it, and now I'm going to add a music track, which I used, Breath by Breaking Benjamin, now I'm going to sync the shot up with the soundtrack. And then, there we go. And it should turn out something like this.